Hello everyone, welcome back to Prepare Intro Tutorials and uh, today we again came up with an interesting video like as I have informed you that uh, we have already learned about uh, 5 days working roster planning using MS Excel now we are going to learn about 6 days uh, working roster planning using MS Excel suppose there are few companies who have 6 days working culture with rotational week offs and uh, multiple shift how they can create their employee roster with the help of Excel today we will learn this if you have 5 days working culture with different shift and uh, rotational week offs kindly check out my latest video which I have uploaded few days back and also I will add the link in the description do check out guys you will find all the information very easily so that you can avoid your shrinkage as possible as you can post planning the roster as per the video let's start today's concept that is on 6 days working culture before moving to the video uh, would require everyone uh, would require to inform you everyone that we have 120 plus videos in our playlist you will find videos related to six sigma certification trainers quality analyst team leader kpis operational management sme wfm many more videos are there do check and share subscribe the channel let's start today's uh, video now six days working planning culture before moving to the video let me set a plan like what is our requirement so that at the final stage it will be very easy to prepare the roster so my planning is very simple that is we have six days working in our office uh, there are rotational week off so I am assuming post removing my 15% of shrinkage multiple companies have their ex uh, expectation like uh, uh, acceptance like uh, they are working with a uh, 10% 12% shrinkage it's up to you what do you want to consider why I'm considering this here post removing this particular shrinkage I need my employees to be rostered properly okay there should be no issue with the capacity and the schedule let's move uh, let's considering 85% as my shrinkage 15% uh, as my shrinkage which means 85% uh, availability I need it and it's multiple shift model okay let's move to our additional details I have 20 HC now in my particular team we are working with two shifts one is morning 9 am to 6 pm and another is 7 pm to 3 am and I am preparing for the roster for my particular team you can prepare for the entire workflow it's up to you guys also uh, as it's 6 day working culture we will give one week off to all the employee considering it as a rotational week offs rotational which means many of will get sunday some will get monday tuesday like it totally depend on it let's move some uh, request what i have received from my employees for the upcoming week that uh, hello pravesh or hello team we want our roster and we want our shift to be planned in such a way okay so saurav needed leave on monday let me copy everything in one another sheet so that it will be easy for me to prepare the roster let me paste it over here yes now this is my roster which i prepared for maybe 25th of uh, december and i'm planning it for jan 1st 2024 how i can prepare it now so to prepare this particular roster first of all i will add my all the 20 employees name okay uh, and you can see here i have added i am considering my shift as monday to sunday a uh, few companies may follow like sunday to saturdays maybe it totally depends on them so you just uh, uh, check it out initially what I did I have added every every employee as a shift as morning shift later on you can change it whatever shift you required okay so before moving to this before moving to this let me come again on this particular page so let me do some calculation first of all I needed how many HC to be roasted every day for that I have total as is 20 HC and 85% of the 20 uh, HC which means 15% are friendly I'm remo removing it uh, for a safer side and okay so which means 80 uh, total HC into 85% now what is this 6 by 7 6 by 7 which means the employee will work for uh, 6 days uh, in the 7 days in the 7 days which means rotationally he will get at least one week off in the last video we have done this like 5 by 7 which means employee will work for 5 days in the 7 days but with the rotational week off now the calculation is very easy what I need to do here is the calculation you can see here F17 which means 20 into 85% into 6 by 7 if I do this calculation doing the round off 
in this way we have done the round off okay i got 14.6 which means 15 headcount mandatory i needed to meet my capacity okay let's move to our roster planning uh, before starting of this what i have done i have added some county formula here uh, to check how many leave request how many week off and how many employees are roster for the day so to do this what you need to do use county formula c o u n t count uh, count if and choose the entire uh, row and uh, comma now add this shift as it is uh, considering space and everything should be added properly zero zero double quotes and bracket close Okay, count is zero zero. Two zero nine. Okay, let me paste this only as it is here to get my formula very easily. Okay, fourteen. I got this. Let me drag it to all the cell. I have dragged it. Okay. Let me remove this additional one. Okay. Uh, now let me calculate week offs. Let me calculate week offs also with the same county formula. In place of this uh, uh, shift, I will add off. I I hope you know how to use county formula. If not, uh, please uh, do check the playlist. You will find the video on it. I will add the link as well. Okay, and the row got started from G3. It's Z3 actually. Okay, this is done. Let me paste it over here. Okay, my week of added. Let me paste the same formula for leave also. Let me start from again G3. Okay, and I want leave here in place of uh, shift. Leave, leave okay this is done now sorted so everything is added right now the roster is not looking good because if you see here i need minimum 15 employees every day at some place it's showing 14 and some place it's showing 19 which is above to our capacity and we can adjust those uh, week offs here so before that what i'll do i'll just remove the leaves because these are the earlier requests what we have received uh, we have to go with the latest one so i'm just removing with the shift okay let me check now request saurav need leave on monday and tuesday with wednesday's week off saurav saurav need okay saurav is in the last and what is the requirement for the saurav sorry just what is the requirement for the saurav Saurav need leave on Monday and Tuesday. Saurav need leave on Monday and Tuesday. Okay, this is done. Uh, with week off on Wednesday. Let me add week off here. Off here. And he needed leave here. Leave, leave and off. This is off. Let me change the color for the leave. Anything you can keep. It's up to you guys. Let me keep green. Okay, this is done. You can see here now leaves added automatically. Week off also added. We will do this sorting later on. Uh, Kailash needs Saturday and Sunday leave. So, where is Kailash? Kailash needs Saturday and Sunday as a leave. First of all, I will add leaves. Then we will change those into the week off. Okay. So, week off is already there. Let me add one leave for him. Okay. This is done. Why I am not adding two leaves? Because to check either Kailash is happy with one leave or week off or else he need week off separately. It totally depends on the employees. You just need to ask him. Hina need week off on Thursday and Friday and Monday as leave. Thursday. Week off. She needed Thursdays and week off. And Hina need Thursdays and week off. Friday. As checked for Hina it's done. Let me check for Virendra and Joy. 
So safer side I have added for both as well. So whatever requirement we have for Virendra as well as for him. So now everything everything is sorted. Let me make some let me make these boosters more complicated. Let me like consider like uh, Poli also required uh, one week off on uh, like uh, on uh, example on Tuesday. Okay, this is done. And uh, let me do some more complication here. Considering if we are request required multiple week of okay, so this is also done. Everything is sorted. You can see here, guys. Everything is looking really perfect. And uh, leaves are also added uh, perfectly for all the employees who requested to leave. And minimum employees what I required that is uh, uh, four to fifteen, and this is also say uh, perfectly done. But here, what we can do, one more opportunity we can see here. The opportunity here is, uh, example, 15 is neck to neck HC here, right? Which means if anyone have, have taken a UL or unplanned leave, which will impact your uh, uh, schedule. Make sense, right? So what you need to do, let me do some more uh, changes here. Let me check the person who did not have any request. Example, Genie don't have any request. Let me remove Genie's week off from here to Monday. Okay. Yes, now it is sorted. 16, 16, 17, 17, 16, 16. This is looking perfect. Guys, do check if your company is having some uh, rules and policies that employee is not allowed to work 7 days continuously or uh, like employee, we should give a week off to employee on his 6th working day. If we have anything. For an example, Monday is a week off for Ajay and next week for sure he will get Monday as in week off, but you have given him Sunday, which means employee need to work for 14 days. After 14 days, he will get the week off. Check out all these things as well, so that uh, employee uh, like life balance will not get impacted here and prepare it on the basis of it. This is done. Now this is also done. Now we have one challenge. The challenge here is you can see here any given day there are two leaves, right? Let me check if we can make it to one leaf. Okay, see here both Virendra and uh, Joy Mahesh had a same request let me convert in this way let me give leave here and let me give week off here there is no impact because anyhow that person required one leave and one leave week off same you can see here Virendra there is no impact now you can see here one one leave is accommodated so your shrinkage planned leave shrinkage is in control now here we have two leave uh, you can adjust here as well let me give week off here and let me give leave here. Okay, again we have uh, two leaves and which will impact, uh, yes, which will impact the employee. Okay, that's completely fine because if we have a multiple request, we have to take care of it. But at the end, you can see we have 17 employees which are about our capacity. So there will be no impact in terms of scheduling. I believe this roster is easy to understand and you can prepare it for your individual team. Preparing 6 days working culture roster is quite easy rather than preparing 5 days working culture because we have to set 2 week offs with if any of the leave request so that the, the HC will come down for sure the headcount will come down. For the 6 days there will be no such challenge. If you still have any doubt let me know uh, guys so that I will help you out in the comment section. Also here what is this one I just added a county formula to check either all the week offs are added correctly or not which means uh, for any of the employee I have, haven't given two or three week offs because the policy is I need to only give one week off. So I checked everyone got one week off wherein there is no any challenge for it. So this is sorted if you still have any doubt let me know make sure your capacity should be main in your concern once you prepare once whenever you prepare a roster a uh, staff roster. So this is done guys, uh, please share, subscribe the video and uh, share this video with your colleagues who are uh, working as a team leader in any of the department, department like quality trainers or operations or maybe at a high level. So please do share and let them know like if we are preparing Roshan in such way, the capacity will be in place and there will be no challenge in terms of processing the volumes and client will be happy. Uh, by the end of the day so that's all guys uh, thanks a lot thanks for uh, uh, watching our video have a great day